been on site now for just over a year. The first concrete was poured only 11 months ago. And since then, we've poured over 120,000 cubic meters of concrete. The concrete work on the galleries and the basements is almost complete. We've started the structural steel, that's progressing really well. And we've now started to finish off some of the first galleries. You can see the dome is taking shape. It's 180 meters in diameter. The total weight of the dome is, only, is going to be over 12,000 tons. What we see in the back here is the structural steel frame for the dome. That's about 7,000 tons of structural steel. Over 11,000 beams are being used to build this steel truss, the space frame that will make the dome. And then we'll be clad with aluminum strips on the top side and the underside to create this crisscross shadow pattern of as the light passes through the dome. We can see the dome in the background, but we can also see the concrete terrace for the cafeteria that will be overlooking the sea. And we need to take advantage of the location on the sea because it is a destination. When visitors come to this museum, they're going to be seeing the exhibits, but they will also have the restaurant and the cafeteria and be able to sit out on the water and experience the Arabian Gulf. The construction is proceeding at an extremely fast pace. We're not yet at the halfway point in the construction, and you can see that a significant amount of the work has been done. It won't be long now before all of the structures are complete, and we still have a year to go to finish it off. But the mechanical systems, the electrical systems, and the finishes, they have to be done properly, and we need to focus on quality. Yes, we are going to finish on time, but we do need to focus on making sure that the quality is preserved and we have the highest quality building at the end of the project.